going on gamers welcome back to another madden 20 tip video today we're gonna go over the easiest scheme to have on madden 20 so we're gonna set our audibles we want our cover four we want our cover two and then we want our run coverage defense so if you have that set early in the game it's other things that you can use but that's gonna set the uh momentum of the game that's gonna make your opponent know that you are gonna be aggressive he has to block more people and that's what you want to establish so we're gonna come out in the cover four first so I'm gonna pinch linebackers blitz all and then on this side it might be a uh, play action so we're gonna move them out and there's the play action right there and we got instant pressure we making him know that I want you to blitz more people so he's gonna read cover four drop show two so on this next play I'm a shade outside he goes into empty slant so we're not gonna use it for this situation so we got to take uh base line off go to default and we just gonna hit him with a cover three because we're gonna uh crash out bring him in contain we're gonna double man him up and user him and it's gonna look like this and i'm watching these routes now i got the ability to lurk underneath and he takes off with the quarterback and falls down so he gets seven yards on that and we just constantly putting pressure on him so now he has to think cover four cover three he goes into gun bunch so that's a good defense he's gonna have that running back blocking on the other side so we're gonna flip the play and we're gonna have it the regular way this time so we're gonna crash up just like this the play is all set up now you got to remember over there he might motion that guy out so we're gonna put a double route right there two people in and he throws it and gets big hit now he could have tried to do a vertical zone net fourth and ten we had the blitzer off the opposite side of the running back. So now he's in pistol uh, tight end. So this time we're going to dial up an all-out blitz out of that same formation. And we want to make him make a read. It's real simple, real easy. So this time we're going to go into the buzz. We're going to man him up, put him in a yellow so he can bump that guy. And there he is with the play action. He has to make a read and he throws it right to me. Now he could have took his time, probably threw it to the... Uh, crossing across the middle of the field but he didn't so we get the ball easy right there and we're gonna go over my offensive scheme it's a lot to do it's a lot of motion in in this scheme but if you want the breakdown to it let me know and i will bring that to you so right here don't look like he's paying attention to moss at all so we're gonna break another blocker because he has somebody lit up that's gonna get an easy block shed we're gonna stay in his pocket we're gonna throw it to this outside that's enough yards come down with it easy touchdown when you go into these small packages i got auto base aligned on so i go back to base we're gonna come back into cover four so we're gonna pinch line blitz all and then we're gonna take him right there put him on him so here he is he tries to do a trap we got a big hitter to the outside cover four you got more people in uh run concept so he's gonna read cover four he goes back into the pinch tight end so we're gonna give him that same look that he didn't like this time we got enough time to make our adjustments. We can drop him back in coverage. We got this underneath and we got the two under uh, crossing routes. We had enough time. We had everybody manned up on that left side where his bunch was at. And if he runs it to the other side, you can do the same thing. So he has his bunch over there. He has his bunch over there. I put double zones right there. So I'm not worried about anything underneath except this out route. Ah! I didn't get underneath it. I had that whole left side covered. So now he feels like he's successful with that play. So now we can play around with our coverages behind it. Okay, he goes into Trey. So we're going to take, uh, we got it still set. We're going to go into Trey. You want to send a lot of pressure at him. So he's probably going to be the route that comes back. That's how it's set. We're going to shade out top, outside, and I'm going to play right here. I want to be able to jump a row underneath so we got a lot of pressure coming to him and he might have a drag or an in route and that's what i'm worried about so we're gonna stop that route drag or in route just like i said perfect play call he didn't see that the tight end got bumped and released and he was wide open the pressure goes to your opponent your opponent can't make the right read and this is a perfect example on how to play the best madden 20 defense ever if you ain't dropped no like why haven't you if you want more tips like this you can't show this in practice mode this is something that you have to do live and that's why i'm bringing it to y'all i'll see y'all in the next video let go